Good morning. Uh, my name is Aaron Guthrie. I serve on the team of elders here at Capital City Christian Church, and I have the pleasure of being able to lead us through uh, our community meditation this morning. Um, so for today's meditation, I would like to begin by helping us to adjust our mindset. Um, in 1 Corinthians 11.28, Paul issues the command. He says, But a man must examine himself, and in doing so, he is to eat the bread and drink the cup. For he who eats and drinks, eats and drinks judgment to himself. Church, this is a time of examination. Now what I would like to do is I will read through a passage in Isaiah two times. The first time I will um, kind of add emphasis to what Christ did, and the second time I will add emphasis to, to us. So, from Isaiah uh, 53, 5 and 6. He was pierced for our transgression. He was crushed for our iniquity. The chastening of our moral well-being fell upon him. By his scourging, we are healed. All of us like sheep have gone astray. Each of us has turned his own way. But the Lord has caused the iniquity of us to fall on him. And now again, he was pierced for our transgression. He was crushed for our iniquity. The chastening of our well-being fell upon him. By his scourging, we are healed. All of us, like sheep, have gone astray. Each of us has turned his own way. But the Lord has caused the iniquity of us to fall on him. Father, uh, we know that you are a God of great character, that you love your people. That's a, an everlasting love. And it's not just a love uh, for Nebraskans or, or the United States or uh, a hemisphere. Father, you are a global God that cares for uh, your people. And so, Father, we say thank you for the opportunity we have to interact and rub shoulders in the kingdom of God uh, with people with different traditions, different voices, uh, different opinions, different uh, dialects. Father, I would ask that you would please, please allow the Holy Spirit uh, to be with this team, allow them to grow in their faith. Uh, as they travel, grow in their uh, trust in you as things are going to change, details are going to be upside down sometimes. Father, that you would be an ever-present love for them as they go and do the work of hands and feet. As, as they interact with um, every single person, Father, would you uh, make a way for great conversations? That people would be changed, that they would see the hope and the love of Jesus Christ, not just a group on vacation, that they would see the mercy of Christ, not just uh, foreigners coming into uh, their land, but you would make straight paths so that they would have phenomenal, relationally uh, connected conversations. God, we give you glory. We say thank you for this team. Bring them back to us safely uh, because we can't hear all the stories and the good news of their trip. It's in Christ's name we pray. Amen. 